I hope you fill the arms wide open of God today for you in your life. We're going to continue to worship the Lord. And I ask each one of us, from left to right and front and back, this is for everybody today. It's for everybody, young and old. Is arms wide open to you. Arms wide open. It, it says in Romans, Romans 4 says this scripture, when we embrace and believe the one who brought Jesus to life, the sacrifice Jesus made us fit for God and set us right with God. Yeah. There's no greater thing that a man or woman could ever hear but they're right with God, that they're okay, yeah. that now they can live with their, their head high looking to the one that created the very universe and made you for a purpose, not just to exist and to have life within your lungs but to have eternal life within your being. Today you can be, like the scripture says, be made right with God. Yeah. Like the truth you told, you can't run and you can't hide from God. You can try to run and you'll just find him chasing you. You'll just find him running after you. That's what, why some of you, wherever you go, there's Christians, man. You think to yourself, oh, another stinking Christian. Thought I got away from you lot, man. Man, that's just not because some luck. It's because God's chasing you. Because God loves you. Because God has a great plan for your life. Because He's for you and not against you. You can try to hide from God, but why would you hide from God? Why would you anyway? Maybe you think, you know, it's because I'm ashamed of my life. God's not the one that's going to place shame on you. He's the one to take shame from you. He's not the one to, maybe you're hiding because of guilt and you think I'm guilty and if I look at God or if I admit this or that, God's not the one to put guilt on you. I ask for forgiveness if people that call themselves Christians have put guilt on you because that's not God's heart. He's the one to take guilt from you, to set you free to live, yeah. free, yeah. and to see a life full of colour again, not the black and white of mundane existence, yeah. but to live and breathe and be open with God. Yeah. Come on, man. Maybe you're hiding today because you know, you're just afraid, you're fearful of what God would say because you're not really knowing what which way he's going to react. You, you can imagine what your friends would say or people around you would say, but you're not too sure about what God would say of your life, so you would hide from him. Let me tell you today what God would say to you. Let me tell you what God would say to you. I love you. Come on home. Come on home. That's what God would say to you. Yeah. I love you. Come on home. Yeah. Come on home. I love when you friend right now. In this prayer. In your seat. Where you are. Why don't you just go ahead and pray this prayer in your inner man. And believe in your heart that Jesus is alive today. And I believe that you also will be saved today in Jesus' name. I want you to pray this prayer, dear Jesus. Come on, church, let's all pray this, dear Jesus. I come to you today. Just as I am. Can't, can't hide anything from you. You know everything about me. My past, my present, my future. God, I give it to you. Because I believe you know best. You love me, even before I heard about you. Today, Jesus, I believe you died for me. You rose for me. That today, because I believe, I am saved. The slate is made clean. Things have become fresh. You've made all things new today. Come and be my Lord. My saviour and friend today. I give you my future because you know what's best. How I live for you in Jesus' name. Amen. I want us to give Jesus a hand and have a praise. Join us to the angels and join with the people. Wherever you are on life's journey, I would ask you to take one step and you can come out here and begin. You can tie it up the front here, up the top. Whether your kids from the youngest to the oldest. It's at this age, these guys are six, seven down the front here, up the back.
God began to come real to me. Why don't you guys do that as well today? In Jesus' name, I'm going to ask the band to come right now. We're going to sing a song.